I wasn't going home. Not yet, anyway. But I did have my camera back. To most on the Allied side, Germany was a machine, efficient and relentless. But there were people starving on that train, people that needed help. Ich habe solchen Hunger. Hast du diesen Wagen nichts verloren gefangen? Raus hier! Geh weg! I remember a carriage of wounded German soldiers. Some gestured to me for food. I wasn't the hero Julia thought I was. I couldn't help these people. But I could take photos. One day, I thought, when I'm back in Canada, I'll show people what happened. Was glotzt du so? Geh weg! You know, they let the prisoners walk around, as long as we don't cause trouble. So lass ich mich nicht fotografieren. Was ist los? Nice! Was ist? Was machst du hier? As I took those photos, I wondered, had my plan to get to Kurt's farm even worked? I had ten days at home and barely knew where to begin. I knew only that Luzi needed me. Warum, 
Mama sagt, wir haben nichts zu essen, weil Krieg ist. Warum braucht der Krieg das ganze Essen, Papa? Hat Lotti dir im Krieg geholfen, Papa? Ist Lotti eine deutsche Katze, Papa? Was hat sie in Frankreich gemacht? Meinst du, ich kann auch mal in den Krieg, Papa? Ich will kein Messer, Papa! Ich will auch gegen den Feind kämpfen, wie du! Ich hab solchen Hunger, Papa! Gibt es dann wieder Essen? Was hältst du von dem Namen Lotti, Papa? Passt er zu ihr? Warst du immer noch an der Flugmaschine? Können wir Lotti für immer behalten? Ich möchte eine große Scheibe, Papa. Es tut mir leid, Liebes. Dieses Stück Brot muss lange reichen. Mama hat gesagt, du hättest im Schlaf geschrien. Das erzählst du mir eine Geschichte? Danke, Papa. Du hast mir gefehlt. Guten Morgen, Kurt. Ich habe Dr. Siegfrieds Stethoskop aus dem Dorf mitgebracht. Für Luzi. Luzi, hast du dein Brot gegessen? Wir brauchen Feuerholz, Kurt. Wir brauchen frisches Wasser auf dem Brunnen, Kurt. Holst du bitte etwas? Things were different at home. Weird. We have all changed up here. Maybe it was Lucy's illness. Maybe it was the war. But I never mentioned Max, for I could not speak of my failure. Ich did what I could, but we remained hungry. I remember that little girl so clearly. She was alone. And she was hungry. I couldn't just leave her. Maybe the adults on board could spare a little food. What's the Horton Baron? Whoever that chocolate belonged to, they'd be happy to feed a starving child. Or that's what I told myself anyway. Schokolade, bitte. Mörder, du hast hier nichts verloren. Raus hier! Oh, danke für die.
di cioccolato. And for some reason, it reminded me of the man whose life I accidentally, the man I accidentally sent Allied intelligence to. The German and his cat. Was machst du hier, Lotti? Hier, Kätzchen. Lotti. <lacht> Komm hierher. I did what I could. Hey! Oh, Luzi! Alles in Ordnung? Kurt! Oh! I wish I knew how to help my little girl. I came home to see my wife and my daughter, to spend time with my family, and yet none of us spoke. I thought I could come home from the war. I thought I could leave it behind. But I understand now, Katrin, and I'm sorry. I can never leave the war behind. The war follows me wherever I go. Sure enough, I found myself on Kurt's doorstep. I didn't know how he'd react. It's one thing being friends with the enemy in a tunnel underground, but another being friends out in the open. I needn't have worried, though. Kurt and his family were kind to me. They took me in, gave me a bed to sleep in, cooked me meals. In return, I helped out on the farm and did what I could around the house. A few days later, Kurt took me to a nearby village. There were things his family needed. Lucy, his daughter, was sick. And Germany was struggling to feed itself by that time. Everyone was hungry. <laughs> 